Have you ever wondered why your keyboard letters aren't in alphabetical order? Wouldn't it make more sense if it started with A, B, C, D? Well, stick around and find out why. Let's go all the way back to the 19th century when the manual typewriter was invented. Strangely enough, the typewriters in the earlier days did have their keys arranged in the alphabetical order. However, people were typing so fast that the key's mechanical arms got jammed very easily with this arrangement. So the arrangement of the keys were changed to actually slow down the typing and prevent keys getting stuck. The keys were randomly positioned so that the weaker fingers were used more frequently. This meant that people were typing at a slower speed, which the machine could handle. As a result, the current keyboard arrangement came into existence that we still use today. The current keyboard arrangement was created by Christopher Scholz, who also invented the first modern typewriter in the 1860s, and was called QWERTY based on the six letters that were put on top of the keyboard. The QWERTY arrangement was based on how letters were used in English language rather than the positioning of the letter in the alphabet. Despite the new keyboard arrangement, there was still an attempt to develop the ultimate typewriter keyboard once and for all. In 1932, another keyboard arrangement was proposed based on research that is superior to the QWERTY arrangement. However, it didn't catch on and later on, people found out it really didn't matter what keyboard you use. Because at the end of the day, good typists type fast and bad typists don't. And no one wants to take the time and hassle to learn a new keyboard, especially if it isn't convincingly superior to the previous one. When computers became popular, QWERTY keyboards were already so entrenched that changing them back to the ABCD format was quite difficult. There's even a monument in Russia for the QWERTY keyboard where some people make wishes by jumping on keys. They even jump on the Ctrl Alt Delete if they want to restart their lives. Eventually, the QWERTY arrangement became the standard in computers and in the later inventions that use keyboards as well. This is interesting because the QWERTY keyboard was originally created to slow people down from typing too fast. But I guess it didn't even matter since today we no longer have the problems of a mechanical typewriter. As long as we need a keyboard to interact with our computers, there's no real value in changing the keyboard back to the alphabetical order. By the way, did you know that QWERTY is also one of the most commonly used passwords on earth? So yeah, I wouldn't recommend using it. But what do you think about how our keyboards have evolved? Do you think we can still switch back to the ABCD arrangement? Or at this point, is it just too late? Let me know in the comment section below, but don't fight. Don't forget to leave a like or comment, it really helps out the channel. And as always, thank you for watching and subscribe for future videos about interesting facts and make sure you also check out the videos that are recommended at the end.